This conversation was sponsored by BitSquare, a Tor-based, anonymous, and decentralized Bitcoin exchange. Learn more at bitsquare.io. Vlad Samfir on blockchain governance, Ethereum, and Ethereum Classic. Um, Artchain Casper, his work with uh, his collaboration with Cinero, and much more. Hello, everybody. I am Juan Galt with Coin Olympics, and I had the opportunity to meet up with uh, Vlad Samfir. He's one of the lead researchers of Ethereum, and uh, he's working on Casper right now, the next proof-of-stake protocol for Ethereum. And uh, we met up at a Vancouver uh, Cinero B uh, governance uh, conference uh, a couple of weeks ago, and um, we had a great time, I mean, just in general, in the conference, and, and had some really good conversations. And uh, I managed to get a, a pretty good interview with him. So, you know, here it is. All right. So, post DAO fork. Um, is it like how do you think about this now like is it should we think about how to create safer forks or like what's your sort of you know philosophy on forks now and and I think you answered the question again already but but um do you want to kind of say anything about that sure so um I think that um you know we shouldn't I mean, I think we should continue to do hard forks, uh, and uh, but uh, but I think it's like very clear that you know we need to have conversations about like w what how like governance looks like and what um, you know what kind of processes need to need to need to go into these types of decisions, uh, and how can we make sure that you know uh, we can kind of get whatever is best for the clients uh out of whatever out of whatever governance process we have basically the issue the issue with any of the governance systems that i've really looked at is that they're not guaranteed to do what is what is like best for the clients um and so you know i think like what we should establish first is like shared kind of it's like shared values and shared principles and like if we could you know agree on some basic things that would kind of guide our governance I think that would that would be helpful but I think it's like also super challenging uh, to kind of crystallize the values of the community really um, uh, but you know if we did have consensus on that it would be a lot easier to do governance decisions in a distributed way because like we could kind of check whether or not uh, a, f a f proposed fork fits our values um, so I guess I guess like I think we need more public discourse and more ways for people to kind of share their opinions. Thank you for watching. Uh, there's other, there's two or three other pieces of this interview that uh, you might be interested in. They're right here. And uh, if you're interested in buying some Ethereum or trading some Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Bitcoin, you name it, and the top cryptocurrencies, you can best do it at uh, Bitsquare.io. It's a decentralized cryptocurrency exchange, Tor-based, anonymous. And uh, it's, a, it's a very good platform, so uh, check that out. It's definitely one of the best ways to buy cryptocurrencies and trade them. And um, you have an awesome day.